Happy Thursday, November 22nd, 2018. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. It is your boy, Jay. Welcome to my channel. If you are new, feel free to subscribe. If you enjoy the content, hit the like button. It is much appreciated. Hopefully, you guys are having a great Thanksgiving. <sighs> I don't know why I'm out of breath. <laughs> Hopefully you guys are having a great Thanksgiving, eating lots of food, hanging out with the fam, and I will take you along on our Thanksgiving tradition. What is up you guys? It is your boy Jay. Welcome to the end of vlog talk. Hopefully you guys had a great Thanksgiving. Um, it was a fun time. If you haven't seen my video that I posted on NorCal Slack Guy, make sure to check out the ending. I'm going to show you the ending right now and what happened afterwards. <laughs> be humble, be honest, and most importantly, be well. Be Hello! <laughs> <laughs> and be well. Uh, happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoy uh, um, this vlog for today. It's your boy Jay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, that's my sister and my mom's idea. Make it exciting! Okay. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone! Okay, I'm gonna clean myself up. I'll talk to you guys on the next clip. Uh, I did not read the AA thought of the day, so I'm gonna do that right now. And let's go. So today for the 22nd of November, it says, I've gotten rid of most of my boredom. One of the hardest things that a new member of AA has to understand is how to stay sober and not be bored. Drinking was always the answer to all kinds of boring people <laughs> or boring situations. But once you have taken up the interest of AA, once you have given it your time and enthusiasm, boredom should not be a problem for you. A new life opens up before you that can be always interesting. Sobriety should give you so many new interests in life that you shouldn't have time to be bored. Have I gotten rid of the fear of being bored? Question mark. I can definitely say that being sober, I am no longer bored. I am not itching for that drink. I'm not itching to suppress my feelings or to get rid of um, things I don't want to deal with. And I take everything that challenges me throughout the day as something to look forward to and something to get through. There have been a lot of things going on that have been challenging and uh, I have accepted that this is part of my higher powers plan and I need to get through it. I think this is something that I constantly talk about and um, that's, what, that's what keeps me not bored. So. Yeah, um, I went to my meeting tonight, um, and it's my regular men's meeting where we talk about the big book and we do readings from the 12 and 12 book as well. We talk about the traditions and the steps of AA, and today there was a fellow that has been coming regularly for the past couple weeks, and today he was a little bit off. Um, you know, the holidays affects 
people differently. And, you know, I always look forward to coming to meetings and especially today because I remember and I think about how desperate I was to get help. When I first came to AA, I wanted to find a way to fix my problem. And this was, tonight's meeting was another reaffirmation of me remembering what got me to the doors because I feel like this fellow is not at a place in his sobriety where he has finally come to a place where he's desperate. Um, a little bit of a backstory is that he's been in and out of meetings for over 30 years and he had a slip up a couple of months ago and he's trying to better his life and he did he didn't want to talk today which was kind of odd um he spoke but he didn't really want he kept on saying that i will tell you guys later it's the holidays i don't want to bother you and for me these rooms are places where i feel safe and i can speak freely and for him he wasn't feeling like that today so all i could do is just be there for him and pray that um he'll open up and reach out um hopefully sooner than later so, yeah, uh, today reminded me of my desperation and how much I want to be sober and I want to go through the steps and how much, how important this program is for me. And for that, I am definitely grateful. Definitely grateful. I can say that Thanksgiving 2018, I'm going to remember. I can't say that about 2017, 2016, or even 2015, or dating back to 2010. Uh, I was never there. I was never in the moment. And now I'm living in the moment. And I am seeing all the gifts that my higher power has given me. So I hope that you had a great day today. What are you most thankful for today within this last 24 hours? Um, you know, Thanksgiving happens once a day. But really, we should be thankful for what we have every single day. And most importantly your higher power and your family and your friends, those that are closest to you. Even having a job, I would say. Well, thank you, you guys, for watching this far into the video. As always, let's end the vlog the way we usually do. Remember to be confident, be humble, be honest, and most importantly, be well. Until tomorrow, my brother, I will talk to you then. Peace. Hello! 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 <laughs> I need <laughs> that story.